For hours, the fire could not be contained. Bad today. We don't know what's going to happen now. Bud Newton is a supervisor for 3G. About a dozen employees were working Sunday afternoon. They smelled the smoke and got out. It and makes it sick, all that work we put in and it went in frames. That thing fun full of stuff for our winter surprise. Employees tell us there's a lot of cardboard in the plant. There were explosions in the warehouse. Parts of the roof collapsed. Responders came in from all across the area to help. At least one firefighter was helped out because the force from an explosion knocked him down. 3G employees say this site is unbelievable. It was kind of, oh my gosh, sort of thing. You know, your stomach hit the bottom and your heart goes with it <laughs> because you're like, what am I going to do now? But I'm sure they'll, they'll take care of us. They're all going to have jobs. Nobody's going to lose out, you know, I mean, uh, we treat our employees like we treat our family, you know, and, and uh, that's one reason that get, the good Lord's blessed us. Just last fall, Governor Jay Nixon was at the plant to announce an expansion, bringing nearly 100 new jobs to Wright County. But the dreams of moving forward will now have to wait. Owners have no idea what the cost and damages will amount to, but they know it could have been much worse. All we can do is just thank God nobody got hurt and, and uh, we can always build it back. You know, that's all we can do. In Mountain Grove, Ashley Reynolds, KY3 News.